Hi, my name is Bob Barnes. I'm here with Dr. Marilyn Lombardi, who is my associate in the delivery of a new course entitled Healthcare Innovation and Entrepreneurship. Unfortunately, when people hear the word innovation and entrepreneurship, they think of success as being defined with a new idea. Unfortunately, that's not the case. Success in innovation and entrepreneurship comes from a true understanding of the needs of those people that we serve. In this course, we will talk about a number of key topics. Stakeholder analysis will be one. Another will be market analysis and competitor analysis. We'll talk about the regulatory constraints and the reimbursement constraints that we face in delivering a new device, especially a healthcare device or solution to the marketplace. And in those cases in which we've identified things that may indeed be new intellectual property, we'll talk in depth about patents and patentability. To tell you more, here's my associate, Dr. Lombardi. Hello. I'm talking to you now from Duke University School of Nursing, where we're very excited about our signature initiative in healthcare innovation and entrepreneurship. Now, if you're a healthcare professional working at the front lines of a complex system, you know you've encountered, encountered processes, services, procedures that just seem too costly or too inefficient, or worse yet, harmful to your patient. If you're one of those frontline workers, then this course is for you. If you're a nurse and you've been dealing with a poorly designed medical device and you've come up with an ingenious workaround, well, what do you do with that idea? If you're one of those nurses, then this course is for you. Finally, if you're a biomedical engineer or a business entrepreneur or even an amateur inventor, and you have this novel solution to a complex dilemma, well, how do you get access to the clinicians who can validate and can evaluate your novel idea? If you're one of those people, then this course is also for you.